remember when I told you guys that I was going to share my experience on why I had to shave my beard? Well, here's the video and you guys are about to see a drastic change. Yes, <laughs> I'm still shocked that I had to do this. But anyways, the reason why I shaved my whole face was because it's part of the school dress code policy and I wasn't very fond of this idea, but sometimes you have to do things that you don't want to do. But in this video, I will be showing you guys the behind scenes of the college event that students partake in called intramurals or interims for short. This takes place right after midterms and each school does celebrate interims but not on the same week, sometimes it's earlier or later. And the best comparison that I can make would be homecoming week in the United States where you are going to the football games every night with all your friends. And I was asked by the admin to participate in this year's USC Days pageant and represent Mr. Intramural for the international students. Today is our last and final day of our practice before we do our big show on Monday. And today we're going to be actually going on to the stage that we'll be presenting on Monday. I'm really excited. We've been practicing on this for three practices now. So we're getting into the rhythm and today we're actually going to be doing more things. I'll be showing you the catwalk they'll be doing, the display of how it looks. So see you guys inside. The pageant for entrance week consists of the production number, which is the dance that I'm showing you as of right now, what sport you and your partner are representing, a catwalk, and a question and answer section. However, the student body council decided to only include the production number, introduction to yourself, what department or school is what they call it here to, that you represent, and the catwalk. Since this is a competition amongst the different schools, this will be graded by three judges. Now, for those of you who don't have that much knowledge about the Filipino culture, pageants here are huge. They're really big here in the Philippines. Another very common thing here is also modeling for both men and women. And if any of you guys keep up with the pageants such as Miss Universe, this is the highest level of pageants women from all over the world can be invited to compete. Philippines has been dominating in the past few years. These women have personal trainers for literally anything from the way that they catwalk to the way that they wave, question and answers, etc. As a foreigner from the United States, participating in a pageant may sound weird to some people, especially from the States. And personally for me, it was weird. And I've never been in pageants before, therefore not knowing what to say or do and apparently walk. <laughs> The remaining students who represented their schools have had experiences in pageants and I know because I was watching men and women do pageants on YouTube and the way that these girls and guys were walking and talking looked just like that. So after we do the production number we do our individual walking so you can see right here that the person in the middle will be walking up and then where they stop is when they do their introduction. After they do their introduction, then they do their catwalk, and then you do that for every single person. Good morning everyone. Today is the final day that we do our performance. It's opening day. Now currently it is 4.15 in the morning. <laughs> I need to get ready and get to the school by five. Without any further delay, let's get into this video. I just got here on campus. I am about to meet with my makeup artist and get my makeup done. Hair is already done. Outfit is underneath. I'll show you guys what we'll be wearing, but that's about it.
This is gonna be on YouTube, by the way. I didn't conclude yesterday's video, but I just wanted to say that yesterday was a great success. We had a lot of fun. I didn't place in any of the three Mr. Intramurals. However, it was still a fun experience for me to have done. And I don't mind doing it again, to be honest. <laughs> the makeup part is a little, it was a little weird, but here it's very normal, especially if you're a guy that's modeling. They do put makeup on you. They put lipstick, they put the full thing on, so. What I was doing is very normal, but for me personally, since I don't do that all the time, it looks kind of weird. <laughs> Nevertheless, it was still a fun experience. I'm glad for all the people that came out yesterday. <clears throat> now this whole week, it's going to be a bunch of sports being played. Intramurals is basically sports. So today is day two. This is what I'm wearing. And since we're still in COVID time, there's limited spots that people can go to these campuses. I'm going to be going to Talamban campus, which is the other big campus that we have here at USC. There's four different ones. The one that I'm going to today is the biggest one. So I'll be showing you guys around and seeing all the people that are there because it's a massive.
the USC, there's different departments. And so this campus is mainly for science, anything that's architecture, engineering, those types of things. My school, my campus is more for law, business, and economics. And then I think there's another one in there as well. I believe we have the world's languages at our campus, but those are the different ones that we have here at San Carlos University. There's so many, I don't even know all of them myself yet, and there's different colors for each school that you represent. For my school, it is going to be, I believe, green and black. And it's our last day here for USC Days. Now, this event was actually postponed because we had a typhoon that happened last Saturday. So it got postponed to the following Saturday, which is today. And this event starts from one in the afternoon to eight in the evening. And basically what you do is just hang out with a bunch of people, listen to music at the gym, and I'll be showing you guys what it is. I have some friends I'm going to be meeting up with in just a moment, and I'll see you there. Yes, you have. 